Um, any any uh, interesting things you're employing in your business right now that have been ultra successful with this? Any any or sorry that have been ultra ultra successful for you? Is there any any tricks, any hacks, anything for uh, the nutrition business owner or uh, for the nutrition coach, the aspiring nutrition coach or entrepreneur out there? Remain open minded. Um, I know as a business owner, I mean, I had to suck ass at a lot of things, and I still I still suck at some things today and fail. And, and I know that those are how I learn. And so I made so many mistakes early on. And, um, and you know, I, I think viewing, you know, learning to fall in love with those L's, like looking at those losses as learning opportunities, man, it has, has been, I'm like, okay, good. I screwed up. Let's, let's see what I did. Well, let's see how we can do that better. Okay. And at the end of the day, when you own a company and I got, I got, you know, 10 coaches that work for me and, um, you know, me and and it's not big by any means but at the end of the day it's my fault if something goes wrong like i really embrace that not in like a martyr way right maybe i didn't train them well enough so they did this wrong maybe it's not directly my fault but at the end of the day it's my fault and i take that ownership that's what entrepreneurship is is saying hey like i don't have a boss i'm my boss so if something goes wrong I I, i gotta point the finger at me too what can i do better um and i think a lot of people lack that that accountability and and also just as a coach out there man like building relationships with these people, having a connection-based model where you get to know these people um, and, and you care for them. Like you care, I, you know, the cheesy saying of like, people don't care how much you know, till they know you no. care. Mm-hmm. It's very true. And, um, and that's how we operate. So um, stay open-minded, uh, continue to further your education. Don't get too dogmatic in one strategy and, um, and embrace the journey, man. It's fun. Yeah. I think that's the thing is you got to be in it long enough to get those L, enough of those L's to learn from those L's. So yeah, uh, yes. you know, don't expect it to happen overnight just because if you're doing that, then you're no better than your client that uh, took 10 years to get to where they're at and uh, wants it all done in a couple of months or 12 weeks. 